Before I tell you about the new light bar from EMDR Kit, let me tell you about the EMDR Learner Community. We have a group, a large group of EMDR therapists who are committed to learning together, to learning from each other. We have experts who are giving free talks. We have giveaways and weekly challenges, and we're just making the whole process of learning and getting better what we do better. Uh, so if you're interested, in joining it's free at emdr-learning.com again that's emdr-learning.com now let's get to the new light tube or light bar from emdr kit it has a very interesting design it has very interesting features and if you're into innovation with your emdr work this light bar might be for you here is the interview with Peter from EMDR Kit. Welcome to the art and science of EMDR, and thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you for inviting me, Rosa. How are you? How are you? I'm doing well, thank you. Uh, Peter, so you are from EMDR Kit and you got some news, right? Yes, that's that's uh, certainly correct. We uh, we have been working hard last year to improve our uh, wireless EMDR kit. And we are really excited to uh, bring the news of our improved uh, wireless uh, EMDR kit. It's uh, right here. I already uh, turned it on and uh, I wanted to show uh, or improved design, so it's uh, it has some more robust uh, uh, casing. So it's made from aluminium and it's more uh, robust. So uh, we expect it will be lasting a lot longer. And uh, you can also take it with you uh, with more confidence, and uh, uh, it's uh, more durable. Uh, we also improved the the bottom part of the light tube it has now uh, it's now adjustable in height with the tripod it's a really uh, quality uh, uh quality uh tripod and it's really easy to adjust the height so you can work with it on a table or just uh, in a seated position it's also really easy to adjust the angle so that are some improvements of this light tube and uh, because it's on the tripod, you can also really easily uh, put it in a bag and uh, take it with you. Our uh, previous EMDR kit wireless was quite bulky in the, in the casing. So now it's just a far smaller, much smaller bag. So that's also something we are really happy about. Yeah, and, I, uh, I had a, Peter, I had a chance to test your, your light tube um over the past couple of months and i have to say first of all the tripod the whole setup takes about 10 to 15 seconds you know on a, on a fast day it will take me 10 seconds on a slow day maybe 15 seconds to set it all up to get it out of the case uh and to set it up on a tripod that you created especially for that light tube it's lightweight but it's um it's very stable and easy to assemble yeah, thank you. So that, that's exactly what we also think. Like, and uh, we got a lot of feedback from our customers that uh, are using the EMDR kit on a daily basis, and they are always asking us, like, "Oh, can you make it uh, adjustable in height? That would be such, such a good improvement." So uh, that was really on our wish list. Uh, right, we right. Were... I was, uh, I was also a user of your old light bar and i always had to find the right amount of books to put it oh on. Yeah, yeah, yeah and yeah, yeah. and now it, and now it's just so easily adjustable yes yes yeah so that's that's really something we are really happy about uh and we are also yeah we also made improvements uh with uh with the materials that it's made of so our previous model was made from uh, a plastic material and this is uh really durable uh, aluminium and yeah, it's just just so much more quality. And uh, if it falls, uh, you, you can be almost sure it's, it will not break. And uh, that's also something we really wanted to improve on. 
of course, uh, our previous product, we also tried to make robust, but uh, there were just some limitation in what we could do. So uh, we, we, we really think this is a good uh, improvement. Um, and also, um, we have uh, created some new modes that uh, the light you pass. Yes. Uh, we are from the Netherlands, and in the Netherlands, uh, there is really much support for the working memory theory in EMDR. Uh, and that's also why we want to uh, make our product uh, be able to, to do as much memory, uh, working memory stimulation as possible. So we have uh, designed uh, a mode which we called uh, chaos mode. And uh, in that mode, it's, it's a bit harder to follow the light. Uh, so it's a, a more difficult task. I can, can try to show you. It's a bit hard to get it all in the one screen. Right, right. But... Uh, yeah, uh, just to make things clear, when you were, were you talking about taxing memory, you're talking about the EMDR 2.0. Um, yes, definitely. That is coming from the Netherlands. There you go. Uh, yeah, I, I was able to just see it on the screen. And um, so you created this chaos mode that you can integrate with EMDR 2.0 or uh, taxing memory. Yes. Yeah, so um, as you can see, the, the light, uh, it normally it will just sweep from left to right. And now it will also uh sometimes do something uh that's not uh, predictable um uh, and that makes it really uh much more harder to to follow the light so that's that's the chaos mode and indeed that's uh really inspired by EMDR 2.0 because uh that's much more focused on extra tasks and uh improve in increasing the working memory load even more so that's uh something we really want to uh be able to uh, allow people to do with our equipment. Uh, yeah. So that's one one thing we did. And also we have in the in the app we now have made a interrupt uh, button. I can show you in the, in the screen. So uh, right here there is now an interrupt button. Uh, mm -hmm. And if I press it, the light will uh, flash. And uh, this is really nice for when people are uh, not focusing anymore. Like, uh, uh, and uh, normally what people then do is like uh, they do something like that, or they make a strange uh, uh, wave with their fingers. And now you can just uh, press the button, and people will be uh, paying attention again. <laughs> and also when people maybe dissociate, or it's, it's uh, a good way to bring them back uh, here. Um, so that's also something uh, people have been using now, or, or prototype uh, testers, and uh, both the chaos mode and the uh, interrupt button are really two tools that uh, are pe people are really enthusiastic about. Excellent. And, uh, yeah, Peter. Are... Um, a quick, quick question, Peter. Uh, mm -hmm. Does the new light tube work with the pulsators, the buzzers that you guys have? Of course, yes. Uh, you can use them together with the pulsators and also with the headphone uh, all together or uh, individually. Uh, that That's just like our previous products. Uh, we really have the mindset that, uh, yeah, you, you can use all the tools together or not because uh, uh, in the Netherlands, there is just much support for the working memory theory. So that's that was our base from a scientific, scientific point of view. So we really wanted to allow our users to uh, be able to uh, stimulate the working memory as, as much as possible. But uh, of course, people around the world uh, uh, work differently. Uh, so uh, some people only want to use the light tube or only the headphones. And that's something we of course, uh, allow for and uh, um, people should allow uh, be able to choose. So that's uh, certainly possible. That's great. So, so your new uh, features allow for different ways of working. It's not only the eye movements back and forth. You can do uh, memory taxation. You can do interrupt or chaos mode, 
And these are new yes. features that, as far as I know, are unique to EMDR kit and you can't find with any other bilateral stimulation device. No, definitely not. No, they, these are new features and also unique. And uh, it's it's something that people will mainly use, I think, if, if you're familiar with the uh, working memory uh, theory. And uh, I think that's that's a good theory. Of course, there are many theories about how EMDR works. And we also see a lot of people that don't uh, think EMDR works this way. And it's, that's also something we respect. And uh, of course, you can also use the light tube just in sweeping mode so it will just go from left to right you can easily adjust the speed to go much slower or uh, much faster or make the color go orange or purple whatever you want <laughs> and uh, yeah or whatever your client wants or whatever your clients uh, want yes so uh, you can you can uh, do it all with our new light tube excellent and, uh, and so, uh, yeah, we are really excited to to bring this to market and uh, uh, let people use it. And uh, yeah, we we are really excited. Excellent, uh, Peter. Where can people find you? Where can people order the new light tube? Uh, they can they can order it from our website. It's uh, emdrkit.com, and we deliver uh, all around the world. And shipping time is mostly, uh, most of the times is uh, there in five business days. Okay, so, we... so, th so this is an important point that I, I wanted to talk to you about because a few years ago, shipping used to take a lot longer and uh, some people are concerned about shipping time. I got two light tubes from you, the older version and the newer version. And uh, both of them came in less than a week. Uh, so you, yeah. you changed your career. So if you want to speak about that uh, a little bit, because I know that in our community, some people had concern about shipping time. Okay. Yeah. Well, uh, in previous times, we, we worked with a different courier. That's that's right. And uh, then the shipping time was around one month uh, to the USA. And of course, that's, that's not uh, something we want or our customers want. So we changed our uh, courier to FedEx, and now it's always there within uh, five business days, or that's that's at least most of the times. And of course, there can be exceptions, but uh, yeah, like uh, ninety percent get there uh, within five business days. So that's a, a big improvement. Yes, absolutely. Okay, Peter, thank you so much for your time. Uh, we are excited about new products in the market, especially with new features. So um, you can find the new light tube for EMDR kit at emdrkit.com. Yes, of course. And if, if, you're, if people from your community have uh, any questions uh, or feedback or other features they would like to be implemented, they can always contact us because we are really community driven and uh, features like the chaos mode or interrupt button are really features that are uh, that came also to us by our users and uh, they are implemented now. So we're also really happy to to listen to people and how they use it and what they want from their light tubes or other EMDR equipment. So uh, we're all really open to that. That's great. Peter, thank you so much for your time and good luck. Thank you, Rotem, and I'll speak to you soon.